Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and this is another app review for this week uh, August the 10th today uh, I did a review about Adeta, a game and I was thinking that I should do a review about something that's not a game that's more of a, uh, a regular app that might be interesting or useful in um, Windows 8 and I stumbled across a very simple app that does a very simple job but that's kind of interesting if you're a little scared about security. It's um, a nice little app that scans your ports and it's called Network Port Scanner. Network Port Scanner actually scans the different ports in your uh, router or your machine and sees if any ports are open uh, Basically, when you're installed with a laptop computer or um, you have multiple computers at home, often you have a router, often you have connection to the outside world through the internet, but the way it works is that um, sometimes ports are open or closed depending on what type of device you're using and what you want to use, but one of the scary things about ports is that sometimes the viruses will turn on or open ports to access the outside world so that your computer can be controlled from somewhere else on the internet and so your computer becomes kind of a zombie machine that is uh, used by someone else to simply uh, go through the web uh, do an attack on a website uh, that's how um, service de denial attacks are done. For example, if you hear in the news that a website is down because it was attacked, well, don't think it's those really big internet servers somewhere in an obscure basement that attacks these uh, websites. It's your computer, my computer, everybody's computer. That's the best way to attack because that's the best way you can have millions of computers free of charge that attack the web. So, Network Ports uh, Scanner actually checks for open ports on your machine and if it finds any, it tells you. And that's probably a very simple task that it does, but it's very important. You'll know if you're secure or not. So, um, to get this piece of software, go to the Microsoft Store. Um, you can go into the uh, security section of the store and click Top Free and uh, you'll see Network Port Scanner or you can go once you're in the store into your uh, charms bar on the right side search start typing Network Port and you'll see Network Port Scanner show up in their search just click there click the install button and once it's installed in your machine you'll actually be you'll have this little uh, radar icon right there that you can click on and here comes this very simple window. You can scan ports. You can scan all ports on all IP addresses of your machine. So all you have to do is simply let it scan. Um, it scans basically 10, uh, 1021 ports. And um, you can put a port range. You can uh, scan by IP address so it will try each port on all IPs depending so you have to, just have to do is click scan once it's set up L leave it there leave it scanning all the different IPs the different uh, ports what you want to see is that open ports found stays at zero that means you're pretty much secure it didn't find anywhere where you can access the web in some way uh, so if this program kind of tells you, well, you know, we haven't found any ports open, that's at least a good news for you because it means that your computer is pretty much safe from web attacks. If you have a hidden Trojan or virus that has open ports, you'll know through this port scanner because it's gonna tell you. <coughs> Normally, sorry, <coughs> If you have a router, 
<coughs> Sorry, I just um, swallowed. <clears throat> Normally, if you have a port scanner, you're a, um, a router, sorry, on your network, uh, pretty much left it the way it is. You just, you know, put your uh, information and you've, you're secured your network. Normally, this network port scanner should show up with zero ports found because routers typically all have their ports closed when you buy them uh, the only thing that sometimes you can find is people will tend to open ports uh, I know a lot of uh, Xbox, Xbox users that actually uh, were opening ports for different reasons at a certain time so uh, if you have these types of devices you might have a port opener or two uh, but preferably zero ports is the best way to go so keep it scanning your computer if you suspect that something might be wrong in security. Uh, it's very simple, but it does a good job at what it should do, finding open ports, which might be dangerous on your computer. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe. We have uh, great videos about Windows 8, uh, reviews of software on the Windows Store, and of course with the coming of Windows 8.1 lots of videos showing you how to use Windows and Windows 8.1 how to upgrade, how to do just about anything in Windows 8 so by subscribing you will know when we have new videos online it's gonna tell you if you have that Windows 8 machine you have something you'd like us to talk about as some subject or a feature of Windows 8 we haven't done a video yet let us know. We'll try to put a video online for you. You'll be helping others at the same time. And um, if you got that Windows machine, maybe you're a little lost, take a look at all our different videos. We're explaining how to use Windows 8 to the maximum. Thanks for watching. Hope you come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Bye-bye.